Oh, I don't know if I can have this music done by January. Oh, do you need a hug? Yes. <laughs> Good morning, Center Hill. It's National Hug Musician Day, and MTV starts now. Good morning, Center Hill. Not a familiar face, right? Well, I'm Alvia Walker and Veronica took the week off. Here are your announcements. Tuesday, there will be a student council meeting in the multi-purpose room starting at 7.50 a.m. Also on Tuesday and Thursday, there will be a knowledge bowl practice starting at 10.10 10 a.m. Here's your lunch, birthdays, and weather. It should be cooling off this week. Let's see what our weather woman has to say about it. What's up with the weather, Rye? Thanks, Alvia, and good morning, Center Hill. I hope you're not too freezed out from last week. I'm Rye Dunn, and here's your five-day forecast. Today, we have a mostly cloudy sky with a high of 68 and a low of 49. Tomorrow, you can expect the same as well as uh, some nightly showers. Uh, Wednesday, we get some rain, but don't worry because it it won't cool off the week by too much. Thursday, we get cloudy skies again with a high of 68 and a low of 52. And for Friday, we are greeted with even more clouds with a high of 71 and a low of 52. That was your Weather Center Hill. Back to you, Alvia. Thanks, Rye. Now here's what's happening at the Hill. Tonight, soccer plays against Lewisburg at home starting at 5 p.m. Tuesday, basketball plays against Hernando Away starting at 4 p.m. Thursday, soccer is back in action playing against Lewisburg Away at 5 p.m. And finally, Friday, wrestling has a dual meet at Lewisburg starting at 8 a.m. We will have a full week of sports, so come out and support your Mustangs. Seniors, we have six months. I want money and I know you want money. So here's Maddie with your College Corner. Center Hill. I'm Maddie Fowler here with this week's College Corner. Senior year can be a confusing and challenging time for many as you are trying to make decisions about your future. If you're not sure about going the college route because of financial trouble or you're not sure how you'll pay for college, don't worry because today I'll be covering all four steps in applying for financial aid. Step one, apply for scholarships. Seniors, check your emails as our counselors have been very diligent in sending out information on a variety of scholarships. If none of these scholarships work for you, you should also be looking into local scholarships and grants for more success. You can find these by looking into local businesses, organizations, as well as reading the newspaper. Step 2. Apply early for college admissions and scholarships. Most scholarships come directly from individual colleges. Seniors, you should have either already completed or be completing your college applications now. You must be accepted into the college first in order to receive scholarships, and or financial aid. Step three, complete your FAFSA. I know you've heard it before, but the FAFSA is the free application for student federal aid. And you must complete your FAFSA after it opens if you wish to receive any federal funds. Some schools may require the CSS or financial aid profile in addition to the FAFSA. If you have any special circumstances, contact the financial aid office of the school that you plan to attend. Step four, complete the Mississippi financial aid application. 
The Mississippi Office of Student Financial Aid offers scholarships based on merit and need to students that attend colleges or universities in Mississippi. Apply at msfinancialaid.org. And for more information, contact MOFSA at 601-432-6997. Seniors, you can also apply to receive the Higher Education Legislative Plan, which covers tuition and required fees for no more than eight semesters of college. To get this, you must have a GPA of 2.5, have at least 20 on the ACT, and meet the income threshold on the HELP website. These applications are due March 31st, so it's not too late to apply. I hope this helped, and I hope that you guys have a great day. Back to you, Alvia. That was your show, Center Hill. Make sure you visit our school websites for more announcements, scholarship opportunities, and upcoming events. As always, here is your quote of the day. Gratitude is a currency that we can mint for ourselves and spend without fear of bankruptcy. Fred D. Witt Van Ambroff. Please subscribe and hit the bell to stay notified when we post another video. Thank you for watching Center Hill and have a blessed day.